Hi, I'm Dave McDonald. Welcome to Kids Make Comics. Bold letters for your titles and your sound effects, how to make them. Well, here's how I make my big bold letters. Let's say, for example, I'm going to make a comic called The Adventures of Dave, and Dave is the name of my main character. Well, I want that name to be in big bold letters, to jump off the page and capture the reader's attention. So, let's take a look here. I'll draw my title panel. All right. And the adventures of, I'll probably just draw that out in normal size lettering. The adventures of, now Dave, okay? So what I'll do typically is take a pencil and very lightly, now I'll use a red marker just to show you, but very lightly in pencil, create your big capital letter, D-A-V-E, right? So D, A, and leave a little extra room in between the letters because they're going to grow. They're going to get larger. Okay, so very lightly, I write out the capital letters, all right? Then it's just a matter of kind of tracing around each letter. And in some cases, you have to trace inside of a space. But let's say for the letter D, all you do is trace around the letter D and then inside of this space as well then you're left with a big, bold capital letter D. You could either erase out your original pencil and be left with a nice outline of the letter, or you could color this in and make it a nice, big, bold letter D. All right, all right. And let's see, the letter A, trace around the A, trace inside of this little space, okay? Around the V, and around the E. Okay, there you have it. Now, these are big, bold, blocky letters. You can also do something to your letters that's fun. It's called stylizing. Stylizing, it's like decorating. So let's say, for example, Dave, the character Dave was a ladybug, for example. You could stylize the letters. You could color it in red and make some black ladybug dots, right? If it were a zebra, you could create zebra stripes in your letters, okay? Now again, this is, you could also create some shadow. Let's come off here and make kind of a shadow. And if you want, you can just maybe go around it a couple times, make it really thick, really thick, so that it jumps off the page. Again, you want the name of your title character, I do anyway, to jump off the page, so your, your readers will, will definitely recognize that. Now these letters are very blocky. You can see the corners are very sharp but you can also do something called balloon style lettering. I call it balloon style lettering. All right, instead of, instead of the characters being very sharp cornered, you can have them rounded. Let's say we've got, oh, let's write pow. Sound effect word, sound effect word. Not blocky, but balloony. So you're going to round off those corners. Pow. Pow. All right. So balloony, blocky, stylize your letters, have fun with them, add some color, and that's how you make some great title and sound effects lettering. Dave McDonald's Kids Make Comics is brought to you by ProfessorGarfield.org. Entertain your brain with Professor Garfield.